74 pounder Mike Evans. Questions for uh, Coach Brands to begin with. Tom, can you talk about 184 pounds? Uh, what happened there? Did Brooks weigh in? Uh, well, I mean, he didn't weigh in. We wrestled Meyer, and um, we liked Meyer, and could have won that match. We like our depth. Until heavyweight, you didn't really score any offensive points. Did did they just shut you guys down, or what happened? Uh, you know, I don't. You know, you look at it one way or the other. I know that um, we got to do more, and if you don't do more, then the result that you're looking at right now is going to repeat itself. Tom, did you feel that the winning takedown at 184 was a takedown? Uh, yeah, it's a takedown. It's in the books, man. It's in the books, and probably shouldn't have flagged it. Their guy was on life support with oxygen, so shouldn't have flagged it. They rode pretty tough on top. What did you see? They rode tough on top, and they uh, controlled tied us to death. So, and they weren't rides where they got tricks. They're hard, driving forward type rides, and they came in to beat us, and they did at six weights. Tom, yesterday you said that you said the hard way is to make it go your way. Do were you not able to make it go your way today? You know, there's close situations there where it's got to go your way, and it didn't go our way. And the hard thing to do, I'll say it again. You, here's the thing. I mean, you're not going to get me to say that we're going to define our season or continue to spiral. It's just a matter of what do you, what do you want. What do you want? And then when you decide what you want, then go get it. It's not going to be handed to you. And that's nothing new, is it? With, uh, with the way the sport is and the way it defines you. You obviously don't like losing, but is there ever a, uh, an opportunity and a loss to, to grow and, and build towards the yeah, two I mean, most important? You grow important. every time. That's a philosophy that I think you... Uh, you know, you learn for sure as you get mature. As a young kid, you might not think that way. Your whole world comes crashing down. But, you know, you always go forward. And I'll tell you, this stings. It stings, and you gotta, you got to keep walking. And we're not going to, you know, stop working or whatever. I mean, I don't believe in that was good losses. I don't believe in that type of thing. I believe in the next step you take is a step after an evaluation. And you're evaluating as soon as that final whistle as you're walking up this tunnel. So what do you what do you what do you take from this right now as you walk as you walk up the tunnel? You evaluate I just I mean we answered a couple of questions. They collar tied us to death, they wrote us. Um, things that you guys are all astute wrestling people. You understand the sport and it wasn't pretty. It stings. Uh, did Sorensen do anything um in particular that cost him the match, or was it just a hard ride? Uh, he got ridden. Oh. Um, you know, we have ability to score points on our feet, and it has to come out. And we were, we were, you know, there was too much tight, there wasn't enough space. So, you gotta maybe create more space, more opportunities, more openings. I think you can get guys kind of running past us a little bit more with some space there because of angles and stuff. But, when they're heavy on your head, it's hard. Or they're heavy in a tie, it's hard. Mike, what needs to be said so that this doesn't spiral into anything more than just one loss? It's not the end of the year. It's not the end of the season. Uh, there's another There's another next competition, so you got to focus on that. Who's talking about spiraling? You know, that's what I would say. So he's absolutely right. Anything else? Mike, do, Mike, do you feel like uh, you, I mean, you've got a couple big wins this weekend? How, I mean, can you kind of assess this weekend as a whole personally for you? Um, personally, is I think it was okay. Um, you know, I let I, I let the uh, you know the two tough matches I had. You know, I I let those guys kind of stay in the matches. I think I got I think I got more firepower to open those matches up and do it earlier not just in the third or in the second period to take them down, you know, and get to that get to that leg attack in the first and finish, you know, get to it with a minute left, a minute 30 left, three minutes left, you know.
What was it like walking off the Carver Hawkeye arena floor for the last time as a competitor? Um, you know, it's whatever. I mean, I like wrestling here, but, you know, I want to wrestle on, on the, uh, the raised platform. So that's what I'm looking forward to. Thank you.